My life has been long, but I've never seen anything like that. Tirsa was right. A blessing, not a curse. We were so unsure. I will lead a war party to Meridian. Aloy, how did you do that? Shush, Arana. She's the anointed. We'll go to Meridian, Aloy. I'll bring Mother's spear. Arana. Your father is right. You belong here. You both do. I'm just talking to anyone and everyone at this point. Only talking to the people that I value and matter. Not anyone else. What? In all my years, I have never she seen anything like the mountain. Okay, that's cool. I'm glad. I'm honored to meet you. Oh no, don't. Uh, I'm not. I'm not anyone special. Trust me. Anointed. I misread the signs. Forgive. Oh. I told you, Lanzra, I'm not your anointed. Yes, Lanzra. All my life, you've been treating me like I'm some scum. And now you want to, like, worship me. Aloy. I don't know what to say. Then don't say anything. Say that you'll see me at Meridian. Of course. That much is simple. Okay. But the rest... Complicated. I know. But maybe... If I took you into the heart of the mountain. No. At least. Not yet. Okay. I don't know. Please no don't worries. Me, Aloy. But the goddess chose you to see that. Not me. Right. Ooh, there's a lot of dialogue here. Lover of ladies here, like my video, share my video, leave a comment below because I just love talking to you guys. But most importantly, Please subscribe to my channel, that way you'll be able to get daily gaming content from me. And hit that notification button as well, so you know when I upload my videos. Are your injuries serious? Bruises pale. Bones heal. Don't give me a hunting song, Varl. Are you okay? My body aches, but it's nothing that will keep me from fighting. Okay, good. That's exactly what I like to hear. I'll be on my way then. I always knew you weren't like other Nora. Neither are you, Varl. Maybe if we survive all this, I can show you what I've learned. What I'm learning. Perhaps. If the goddess so wills it. See you in Meridian. Wow, look at all these people. They're shook. I can tell. Okay, so... Look at all these guys. Oh, this man. The tribe I served is gone. Soon I will be too. The Nora have lost too many, Rush. But in your case, I guess they can lose one more. Yes, Alloy. Hunt. Let's go. Cough, cough. Hint, hint, Rush. I bet you're feeling pretty humble right now, knowing that I'm the chosen one. Have you seen the anointed in action? I pity Pray for me. That stands against us. From here Pray for you. The goddess's ears. What? I am not no goddess or I don't know. Stop worshiping me. All I know is I have to go and save she everyone here. Anointed by all mothers. And they're treating me like I'm some sort of an ancient goddess that they've come across. Man, this is gonna be. She I'm not gonna to lie. Us. I'm a little bit annoyed for Alloy too, because bro, now that you know that I'm the chosen one, that's why you're suddenly treating me with, what, respect? Screw that. I'm, I'm no different. I'm really not. So, cut it out. Okay, I'm finally here. Got some supplies for me. Thank you. I appreciate it. Now it's time for me to climb here, because you know why? There's always a convenience climb for me to go through. Horizon Zero Dawn logic, if I say so myself. The way to the mountain will be hard. Ferocious machines prowl every step of the climb. More corrupted. Not corrupted. But they will not tolerate humans. So what else is new? 
Okay, how am I supposed to? Obviously, this is a jumping point. So I'm definitely not going to go through here. But how else am I supposed to climb? I don't see anything. Am I supposed to... Hold on, I'm just trying to figure this out here. Because if I go down there, I'm going all the way back down to the very beginning. And this was a climbing point. But I don't see any other climbing spots. You know what, screw it, I'm just gonna go down. Let's go, Alloy. Ooh. Whoa. Oh! Haha! <laughs> Found it! Woo! Okay, just be careful. I don't wanna... Woo! She has such upper body strength. I admire that in Alloy. The way she's able to push herself off like that. Watchers on the other side. Okay, there could be as many stalkers and watchers. I'm still gonna I'm sti I'm still gonna conquer and prosper. That's that's my motto. Oh man, I don't have enough meat. Let me go ahead and quickly clean out my inventory because I definitely want that meat. Hold on. Okay, I did manage to get rid of enough, so I should be able to grab a good chunk of stuff. What is that? Yeah, I hear you. I hear the turkeys go. Okay. Once I get to the ruins of the Gala Prime, we should be able to just stop the production of all of these bad machines. Eh, should I? Nah, another time. Oh, what is that? Oh no, they found my location! Excuse me. You're going down. Let's go. Woo! Oh! Oh no. Oh, oh gosh. And I have enough to craft. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. There you go. There you go. Oh no. Oh no. Ooh, I missed. There you go. Come here. Look at them bullying me. Look at them bullying me. Are we done? Woo! Okay. Cut it out. There you go. Okay, okay. I should be I should be good with just the regular Ammo. Shut up! Okay. Who else is here? Who else? Bye. Ooh, not good. Come on, thank you. Alright, am I done? I know every machine in that area has heard me. So let me go ahead and get the... the loot and I should be on my way because I'm not trying to stay here too long and then I end up coming across more machines you know all right good I like this oh it's it's those things you know what might as well right might as well might as well let them know that I'm here so annoying that's coming with me yeah, look at all this loot. I love getting free stuff. That's my motto. Okay, so everything's empty here. Beautiful. More stuff for me to climb, because why not? This is what I'm made for, just to climb stuff. Come on. Thank you. I like these little mini obstacle courses, though. It's pretty cool. Feels like I'm in an episode of Double Dare. If you guys know that show, props to you because that's a 90s throwback. Do they think they're guarding Gaia? I doubt they think it all. Same. Instant, gathering them to her grave. Ooh, 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 get the hell out of here. Oh, hell no. Alright, I'm gonna sneak, cause I'm not really in the mood to, you know... Ah! Alright, 
Okay, he has found me, so let's go. Ah, uh, this is gonna be a long, long, tribulous episode of me fighting for my life. Come here! Where you at? Oh, how did I miss? How did I miss? Great! Look at look at this little midget robot thinking that he's doing something. Bye. Bye. And I got a bird on me. WTF. Oh gosh, all the birds are on me. No ammo, huh? Oh my gosh, I have everyone and their crew trying to get me. I don't even want to do... I don't even want to deal with this. You know what? I'm going to be brave enough to say I'm running away. I'm running away. Woo! Alright. Let's go. I'm done. I'm done. I'm not going to waste my time fighting with these machines. I'm running away. Ha ha, y'all can't get me, losers. Losers. Anyways, let's go. Come on. Come on now, Loy. Let's go. It's getting dark, I can tell. This this is going to be hardcore tribulation on my end. It really is. Oh my gosh. Who is attacking me? I am literally just trying to climb, bro. Come on now, Loy. Let's go. What? Okay, good. So, I'm in the middle of the storm with little to no proper snow gear. Because, you know, I, I don't get sick. Oh, no. Do I have enough? So, yeah, I don't get sick. Can I just, I don't know, run? Alloy, please. We don't have any time for any lull of gagging. Let's go. I'm not even gonna bother with that bird. I just need... Oh, snap, that sucks. Thank you. I just need to leave. Hurry up, Alloy. Today, Alloy. Come on, we're so close. We're so close, Alloy! I can't even climb here, huh? Okay, this way, this way, come on. Come on, come on, we got this. Look, we're almost there. I'm not in the mood to fight any bird today, sorry. I'm not trying to waste time. Guy's sacrifice. <sighs> Did this. Cracked the inside of the mountain. Damn, that's crazy. That is sh yes, wow. Yes. Quickly now. I prepared the way ahead for you. Okay. So you've been in here before. To a point. You'll see. Okay, Alloy, I get it. You're cold. I'm sorry. Let's go ahead and keep on moving around. The more you move, the more you get hot. So you made a climbing path for me, but left an army of machines for me to deal with. Since when were machines any obstacle for you? You're a jerk. If you fly, I wouldn't have bothered with a climbing path either. What a jerk. You know what? I don't care that he's helping us. High key, he's annoying. Are you afraid of heights, Alloy? That's that would be funny if you are. Wow, this is never ending. This is why she has really good triceps and biceps. The amount of climbing that she has to do is phenomenal. All right, we're here. Finally. This is exactly the kind of place I expected to find you in silence. Thank you. It's one of many workshops I've constructed over the years. Of course you did. I'm not even surprised. For years, I tried to get through this hatch. I drilled, I burned, I blasted. But we both know that you won't have any trouble getting through. You make it sound like I should apologize. Not at all. It never occurred to me that the way through would not be with force, but with a key. A key in human form. The failure of imagination, 
was mine, not yours. Okay, that's cool. I thought you might actually be here this time. Actually, here. Why? My presence is unnecessary. You don't need my help to pass through this door. You were the one born to do this, not me. Born to do this, but you were the one who was helping and making sure this whole mission goes through. In her message, Gaia said we could restore her, but after seeing the damage, how could that be? She said any effort to repair her must come after Hades is destroyed. I concur. Rebuilding the terraforming system now might allow Hades to use it as a weapon. Because of Gaia's sacrifice, it has been forced to search for means that are less... convenient. But... do you think it's even possible to restore Gaia? You know what the cauldrons are capable of. How they fabricate any technology necessary to create a machine. By the same principle, it should be possible to replicate every technology necessary to repair Gaia. But that would take years, and we're counting the time we have left by the hour. Looks like you've spent a lot of time here. Nineteen years ago. Nineteen? A great explosion destroyed this mountain. Gaia's death. Your birth. Okay, that the echo sounds... could be heard as far as the claim. Chaotic. darkened the skies. How they fretted in Meridian as they tried to read this omen. The crater burned for weeks, but when it cooled, I was the first to behold what lay within. Over time, the machines closed ranks to protect it. Useful. Soon, no one dared to come here. Except me. Interesting. Okay. That's cool information, Silas. It's time for me to head in. Yes. When you find the Master Override, you will gain the power to defeat Hades. Everything depends on you. No pressure, am I right? Oh, man. Entry authorized. Greetings, Dr. Sogan. You are hey. To cool. Thank you, machine. Appreciate that. Let me explore this cave here. Yes! Thank you! I need all the supplies that I can get. Logging arrivals! Shan Margo? Welcome to Frozen Hill. Population 10? 11 counting Gaia. Don't count your chicken embryos before they incubated, hon. She's still firing up. Be a while Mind before you feet. eat that omelet. I'm vegan, Travis. You'd think we'd worked in the same secret base long enough for you to notice. Oh no, I'm she's pissed. The shack up here for another three weeks. You realize I just lost 350 kilos of pre-code smut comics in transit. Oh no, Wait, not the actual smut. Actual physical media. Why didn't you have it digitized? Can't beat the feel of physical media on your fingers. And in here we ain't gonna be touching a whole lot else. Figured I was gonna pass the time archiving them. What about you? Me? At work, I guess. My task queue stretches out for, like, three years. There's a lot of sharp edges to round off. After that, I hadn't really thought about it. Oh, you will. You what, 30? Reckon you'll be the one turning the lights off at the end. Food for thought, huh, vegan? This sucks forever. Nah, not forever. Just the rest of your life. Travis, you horny little jerk. Cut it out. Alright, where am I supposed to go? Here? Yeah? Woo! And I thought I was gonna die. Okay. Yeah, that's a long drop. If it wasn't for that ledge, I would have been gone. Rest in pieces. Oh! Oh, why is it shaking? All right, let's go. Come on, Eloy. Jump. Woo! How does that not hurt her hands? Then again, she's probably used to it, so... Okay, so this way? Where am I going? Hold up. Where am I going? I'm a little lost. This way, okay. I guess that's my way across. 
All right, let's go. Jump. Whee! Oh! 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 Okay, okay, okay. Chill. That's all I have to say. Let's go. It's, Woo! Uh, held like this for 19 years, right? Well. D don't answer. Man, that jump got me goosebumps because I could have died. You know, oh, Alloy's a better oh, athlete than me. I would have been dead since the first mission. All right, do I jump here too? Okay. Where? Oh, this way. No, 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 no. Can I just jump? How far down is it? I'm scared. Okay. Right here. Yep. And then there you go. Not too bad. Sweet. Not this way. Maybe further up the shaft. I mean, I got supplies, so it's not too bad. But damn, I have to climb all over again? Oh, yes, I do, I guess. Okay. Uh, right here. Come on, Eloy. Climb, climb, climb. Let's go. We got a long way ahead of us. Ooh. There you go. Up, oh, we're here. Sweet. All right, let me make sure I don't fall. Ooh, what's in here? Nothing. Just a distraction. Ooh, look at the view. So dark and abysmal. Okay, this is cute. This is a bed. All enclosed by rock and metal. Yeah, Alloy, don't think about it too much. It'll be depressing. This is a shower area. How cute. Another voice recording. The cord. I just woke up. It's... I see the numbers, but can't make out the time. I was dreaming of... Uh, I was giving a lecture in Q-Hall. Maybe it was something more... Shamanistic, I, I don't know. An audience of shadowy faces under a blank open sky. I told them the world ended with a bang. A plague of robots. With the last humans. We went out, not with a whimper, but a whisper. That's the person. You know, caves ending like we started huddled around a flickering glow. The heads of state, the fortune fives, the leaders, and lottery winners, and life cults. All of them buried in their little shelters. Some believing they'll live it out some way, somehow, or Elysium, or us here at Gaia Prime. No different. A multitude of tiny societies taking hold, flaring, dying. Some will be beautiful, some horrific. None of them matter. Short term civilizations. One last gasp. One last gasp before the long-held breath. Before I wake up, I know the audience is gone. I'm talking to myself. To a quiet planet. A barren sphere. Just Gaia. And her long, long dreaming. I hope she won't be lonely. I hope... Damn, if only she was alive long enough to know that she's not. No time to think things through. No time for goodbyes. There were lines in the medical ward. I told Tom Pake I'd be with him when he went under. But there was one last shipment of Paradiseides zygos I could get processed if I rushed. I'm still angry at him for forcing me to choose. Angry at myself for... Well, he died alone. And I didn't get the bloody birds of paradise saved either. All the time left in the world now to think. Gaia Prime's locks are sealed. Elysium sealed up. Elizabeth's room. I know it. She didn't even get a chance to unpack. Wow. Elizabeth's journals. And they're all destroyed. What? Scan them. The focus can rebuild them, but the process is slow. To us, it seems a powerful device, okay. but its engine is tiny and limited. How slow? Days, weeks, years. Concern yourself with stopping Hades and extending the future, and you might live long enough to hear them. 
I've been listening to the last two journals, and it's like... Damn, really? If only these scientists knew that all of their sacrifice and hard work actually... actually became worth it. I mean, we're alive for now, but still. We're actually alive. The only bad thing is, we're back to square one as far as trying to stop said machines. Wow. What is this? A shrine, basically. This is Charles Rodson. I'm logging this six hours after final deployment of Gaia Prime. This morning, an access port seal malfunctioned. Gaia Prime's port seals were designed to close with a seam of less than two millimeters. But this one closed with a ten millimeter gap. Enough for an energy signature to bleed through. Enough for the swarm to detect this facility. Enough for Gaia to be discovered and destroyed. Enough to end the future we worked so hard to make possible. Unless the hatch servos were manually re-engaged from the outside. Wait, what? I'm switching to a recording of the event. Okay, show me well, what I'm happened. Not going out there. Now, who has signed up for? Either we sent someone out, or all of this was for nothing. It should be Liz's decision. So when is she going to get here? She said five minutes. You don't think she's dead? Okay, everyone. I've repaired the seal. Gaia? Seal closure at 1.4 millimeters. Confirmed. Elizabeth, no. We'll find a way to bring you back in. It's not gonna happen. The swarm's too close. Really. It's all right. Gaia's complete. She'll take care of things from here on out. That's what she does. Th so this is how Elizabeth not died. like this. There's so much we- Guys, you know me. I'm- I'm no good endings at letting things end, so, um, let's not. So, uh, happy trails, Liz. And, uh, see you around. Yeah. Take care of each other, all right? Liz. I'm okay with this. I want to go home. So that's how Elizabeth dies. That was the last transmission of Elizabeth Sobek. She gave everything for the hope of life on this planet. And we are all in her debt. Wow, that's crazy. Oh, Elizabeth. That's crazy. Hell, Liz. I know. I know you're never gonna hear this. That's not the point. You, uh... <laughs> you got to play the savior in the motor all at once this time. Great work. Bye, Ted. Whatever. <sighs> Look, Liz. You are a pretty stand-up gal. I'm sorry you died. If you had a home to go to, I hope you got there first. But this monument Ronson's made to you? Kinda creepy if you ask me. Rest in peace, Liz. God knows you earned it. Thanks, Travis. I appreciate your sentiments. You'd hate it, Liz, but I wrote you a eulogy. If I had to try to express... All your... Children... After all Apollo has taught them, they'll think they know everything. But they have to understand what you did for them. How you loved the whole world so much. With an intensity that was... Dazzling. Bruising. And in the end, it killed you. 
or you died for it. Different perspectives. No one could keep up with you, live up to you. I, I don't know, maybe if, if, I, if I hadn't taken that postdoc in Joburg. <sighs> I'm glad you shot down the Lightkeeper protocol in the end. I don't think I could have taken seeing another one of you. I mean... Elizabeth Sobek. There's only one. I miss you. That is so ironic because, look, here I am, a carbon copy of Elizabeth. And it's so weird just listening to these people mourning for Elizabeth, a, a, the, the original. Like, I'm over here mourning for someone who looked just like me. This is a, such a trippy experience. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.